Yeah, those long trips can be tricky if you don't handle it right. I was proud of the way we handled it. It was a business type approach. Um, had some fun on the way there, practicing the Colts and, and doing some things. Kind of fun to be in my roots where I'm from and seeing some buddies and have a ton of family in Ohio. But for the team, yeah, I thought I thought we were really focused and, and uh, you know, it was, it was kind of an, an about us type day. And I was proud of all three phases. Uh, really played well early again. Got off to a hot start again. You know, again, our, our offense continues to capitalize on opportunities but man that defense just continues to come to work every day and I could not be more proud of that defense the way that uh, they're showing up every day the attitude they have the, the relentless uh, attitude they play with it just kind of sets up our days for us and offensively to be able to take advantage of of what's been given to us by that defense is uh, really working together well and, and the kick game's been great um, you know so excited about the way the trip went you know it's like it's good to feel uh, that, that, that we were frustrated a little bit because expectations are high. You know, I was like proud of us for being frustrated in, in a win that was, that was, you know, semi lopsided. But I give, I give Ohio Wesleyan a lot of credit. They're going to win some games. It's a good football team. They're tough. They played us hard. They got some stars on that team. Um, you know, and I, I told the guys, like, college football wins are hard. We've got to enjoy it and, but move on and, and keep getting better. Well, he's such a threat both ways now. You know, I think that uh, he's, he's, he's always been a great runner and a good thrower, and, and I think you see his improvement throwing the football now, his decision-making, he's kind of mastered running this offense. And um, I just can't say enough. You know, all those things that you see on the field are, are incredible. But like the work he's putting in behind the scenes this summer, the work that he put in, you know, I, I have the honor of, you know, coaching the quarterbacks and, and, and seeing him right by me every day, the preparation and, and how much it means to him and the, the new leadership role he's taken with this football team. Um, he deserves every bit of this thing. He, he, he's he's allowing the talent that he has uh, to, to equal. Um, how hard he's working now, and, and, and I said all along quietly, I thought I thought he was a player of the year candidate in this country. I really think he might be one of the best players in this in this nation, and I think he's shown it some, you know. But he knows he's got a long way to go, and he's going to continue to get better. And he's right back to work. I saw him in there just now, lifting his butt off and, and, and getting ready for next week. So, but yeah, I'm super proud of him. I, I've I've been had the fortune of getting to watch a lot of great quarterback play, and and. Uh, that's as good of a day as I've ever seen a quarterback have. And, and he left some out there, and he, he would be the first one to tell you that. So he's got some more in him. So, uh, but yeah, proud of him. And, and the supporting cast he's got is making, making it easy for him, too. He's getting that ball out quick, and guys are making plays. So, but yeah, what, a, what an incredible day. Those numbers are, that doesn't happen very often. I think the goal this week is, you know, the standard's the standard. We have high expectations. We have a culture built on hard work and, and you know, out preparing teams and, and, and nothing changes. You got an opponent that you're going to be highly favored in. That's no secret. That's, you know, not going to hide that from the team or anybody else in the public. Like, you know, this is this is a team that we're expected to beat. Um, but, you know, again, the standard's the standard. The culture's the culture. It's about us again this week. And um, I, don't, I don't care who we're playing, whether it's a JV team from a local high school or the Green Bay Packers coming in like it's time to get ready again and you know championship teams out prepare and they work hard and they do the right things and they focus on the little things in the process and it's right back to that again this week and they will again I just came from that weight room again and they are back at it like it's the national title tomorrow so uh, pr proud of our our process here and again it's about processing us but um, I'm going to challenge them to play as hard as they can.